Um, in the last few years, uh, we've been campaigning for a Welsh language measure, and the first step of that was the campaign to devolve uh, powers over the Welsh language to the National Assembly. Um, part of the powers were devolved, but not everything, unfortunately. And following that, the um, Welsh Assembly government uh, passed the Welsh language measure. Uh, we had been campaigning for um, official status for the Welsh language, which was granted in in the in the new measure, um, and rights for people to use the Welsh language and the Welsh language commissioner. Um, fortunately, the Welsh language commissioner has also been included in the Welsh in the new measure, but not rights to use the Welsh language. Um, and we think um, rights are necessary because rights is what empowers people to use the language. Um, what we've got at the moment is uh, a measure which is very much alike to the 1993 measure, which enables people to use more of the language and enables more access to the language, but doesn't actually empower people um, to um, demand their right and have the dignity to use the Welsh language when they feel they need to. Um, well, a massive campaign at the moment as well is against the cuts um, to public spending. Um, we think the cuts will affect um, every community in Wales and um, we think the community and um, is the most important uh, thing in Wales and communities should be able to decide their own future. So, um, and the Welsh language is so dependent on communities. If communities deteriorate, um, well, so will the Welsh language as well. And if people have to move away from those communities to find jobs, well, the Welsh language will suffer as a consequence. So we're, we're fighting against the cuts at the moment. And part of the cuts um, is S4C, which is our Welsh language channel. Um, S4C is a very unique um, um, investment in the Welsh language because it means that um, there's a there's a Welsh language channel so people can hear and see the Welsh language every day uh, on the television um, and also because it, it people can work through the medium of Welsh as well um, which is very important. Um, so the cuts will mean that well possibly the Welsh language will have to fight for um, fight against English language programmes for funding to make the programmes, which will take us back to a situation in the 1970s where, um, you know, Welsh language had to compete against, um, for many against English language, which isn't, which creates tension between the both languages. So there isn't a pot especially for Welsh language programming. Um, so that's our big campaign at the moment really to ensure that um, SOC stays independent editorially and uh, administratively and also has um, uh, clear funding in statutes so that it knows that it's got a future um, and so can plan ahead um, for, to make um, quality Welsh language programming. The um, numbers of Welsh speakers are rising and that's because of the uh, very important uh, battles that have been won uh, in education and more and more people are able to have be edu educated through the medium of Welsh and which is a brilliant thing um, but what we're seeing at the same time is the decline of Welsh language communities and what we think is you know without um, the communities or people being able to use the Welsh language outside the classroom you know people are not going to see the Welsh language as uh, important part of the life or, or something relevant so you need to have um, the community a culture as well that people can be involved in and that's what's really going to you need everything really to fit together so it's not just education it's not just um, culture it's not just media it needs to be the full package so that people can truly live their lives through the medium of Welsh At the moment, I, I come from Carmarthenshire and I was brought up in a Welsh language community um, at the moment I'm living in Carnarvon, um, it's a very interesting situation because the town itself has a lot of Welsh speakers but outside um, in the rural communities the Welsh language is declining um, and in here Cardiff because of the um, jobs and the opportunities to work through the medium of Welsh in Cardiff through media uh, mostly, um, you know you do hear a lot of Welsh speakers and there's been a massive increase in the last 20 years uh, of, Welsh, of the Welsh language in Cardiff, which is a great thing, of course. Um, but, um, you know, 
that, that needs to be normalised as well and the Welsh language needs to be find its roots in the city. Um, and also I think uh, the children being brought up now in Cardiff, they have got more access to the Welsh language but they need not only to hear it in the classroom but also to have um, um, different activities outside school through the medium of Welsh.